Hey guys, this is Sadie Bug here, and today I'm going to be giving you some high school volunteering ideas based on your favorite school subject. So if you like math, some ideas you can do is volunteer at a math center and help tutor kids that are younger than you or help children with disabilities. You can also tutor at your school, which might be more convenient. Another thing you can do if you like math is become a thrift store cashier. You can learn job skills and manage merchandise and money. Another thing that can do that involves a lot of math is doing a 5k runs walk organizer and these walks and runs all often require planning and math skills to organize and finance these things so look for those types of opportunities moving on if you like science hospital volunteering where you can help patients and visitors it's a great idea if you're interested in medicine you could also volunteer at the aquarium and zoo and learn more about marine animals and plants and animals if you're passionate about that Another thing you can do if you're, this is not really volunteering, but a great opportunity, is look into research internships that you can learn more about bio biology and chemistry. Also, a lot of science centers have many volunteering opportunities for science camps for ch younger children. Another thing you can do is, if you like reading and history, is volunteer at a historic History Museum, City Hall, and you can help with campaigns and political science, and book drives if you can donate books in areas in need or other international places. And also volunteer at the library and help organize books and help people find resources. Other ideas you can do is help at nursing homes, feeding banks, donation centers, beach cleanups if you're passionate about the environment, national parks, building houses, and the Red Cross. And before you volunteer, you have to make sure you ask yourself these questions. If you're earning monetary benefit, if you are earning monetary benefit, then that is not considered a volunteering, but it's a, it's a job and you can also write about that in your college applications if that's what you're why you're volunteering. You could also ask yourself how you can verify your hours usually has to be someone that's not a parent or guardian so can you have someone to sign off on them if you're old enough so a lot of these a lot of these places have a minimum age requirement and you need to make sure that you that you meet those requirements it, can you make the time commitment and when does it start so when you when i mean by when does it start you have to make sure that you register by the right dates Especially if you want to volunteer in places like hospitals and zoos and aquariums, they usually uh, open applications in the like in the springtime or like near December because they need to do a lot of tests. So make sure that you keep on top of those, and you also have to make sure that you're passionate about, about what you're doing. That makes volunteering a lot more fun, and it shows that you have interest in your, the community. So where to find volunteering opportunities? You can find them in websites such as Volunteer match you could just do a simple internet search and also schools have great opportunities for re for opportunities to volunteer okay that's it guys thanks for watching make sure you like comment and subscribe for more videos like this have a great summer bye